once you get done cutting that out, here's what you're going to do. Pay close attention. Alright, so look. This is what you cut out before, right? Like that. Take it out. Flip it around. Fold it like this. And set it back in like that. But once you get in there, you're going to tape up here to that. And you're also going to tape there, right here, to right there. Okay, what you're gonna do now, so, and if you have another box, works perfect. Take the top off, what we're doing now is we're actually putting a wall right here. So what you're gonna do is cut out, estimate piece about inch and a half. You're gonna cut another piece off. So, now what you're gonna do, take your piece, you're gonna put it right here. Well, actually, just flip it around like this, so the white side is over here, so that when you put it on the wall, you're going to trace on the outside of here. You know, trace right here, and also going to trace right over here. When you get that traced out, cut that out. Once you get that cut out and traced and whatnot, you're going to take it again and the other piece. You're going to put it on top of there, trace out another piece, and um, we'll be right back. Once you get those side pieces cut out for the wall, you're going to go ahead and cut out the bottom. Okay, so once you get that cut, you don't really have to cut the whole thing all the way around, just to be clarified. But if you did, don't worry, it's okay. Um, you can also cut right here, here, and here, unfold it, do what you got to do on the inside, what I'm about to show you, and cut it off if you want, or just tape it back. With your two pieces that you cut out for the walls, you're going to um, flip it around, and you're going to make sure that this piece goes here, and that the other piece goes on the other side. Now you're just going to flip it over, like this, and you're going to put your piece inside. And once you do that, you can kind of see that it makes a wall. And you're just going to simply tape it. Put some tape right here, around there, and on this side over here as well, and around. Uh, let me put this little note in here. If you taped on the inside and you have that little flap from earlier still up here, just put some tape on that and go all the way around like that and um, it'll be good. So this is what it should look like when you get done taping on the other side. Something like that. Technically you're done. But if you want your phone stand to be more stable, you're going to have to put some tape on this edge, that edge, and as well as around here and around there. See you guys next time. Peace out.